Hey guys, it's Manuel right here, and uh, in this video, I just want to show you how to make a button in Photoshop. Hey guys, it's Manuel right here again, and uh, in this tutorial, we're going to make um, this kind of button. Okay, so um, well, let's go. We have to go here to file and then open or create a new document. So here in the press it, so we have to to, to use web and um, the size um, 800 by 600 pixels. So the mo color mode is very very important. I'm going to, to put here the name, the document's name, and um, we just click OK. So, okay, uh, for this tutorial, we're going to use this tool, the rounded rectangle. So, um, I'm going to click right here, and uh, we have to, to do double click in the middle of our document. So, here in the width, so it's, it's important, it's very, very important. So, I'm going to use, uh, we have to use 200 pixels in the width and the uh, height. So, we're going to use. Um, 80 pixels in the radius so it is okay 10 pixels so it depends of the result you want to get but uh, for this dimension so it is perfect 10 pixels so we click OK and uh, we have already our button right here okay I'm going to select all the document to align this uh, button to the middle so right here and uh, Okay, so I need uh, to put the color of our button. So I just uh, chose a few colors uh, before, and uh, I'm going to paste it right here. So okay, it's okay. So we need the shadow. So we need to add a shadow, and uh, I have here this color. Just okay, this code. And uh, to add that shadow, so we have to go here to the layer and uh, then do right click and go into the blending options. So here in the layer style, so we we're going to add a drop shadow and this is the magic. So, okay, in this part, so we have to change the opacity to 100% and the blending mode is okay, multiply. But here we're going to change the color. So remember that we have here the color code here, and that we're going just to paste it. This depends of the colors you want to 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 use. You want to get. So okay, here the next part is the angle. So okay, here so we're going to to disactivate. We're going. We're gonna. We're not going to use uh, this part. To use global light. So I'm going to just to uh, remove that option. Option, and uh, in the angle. So we have. It is very very important using <coughs> 90. Okay. Um, okay. That's fine. So in the distance, uh, I'm going to just. Uh, we have to use eight pixels. Yeah. And uh, okay, and the size we have to change this to zero, and that's it. Okay, these are the or this this is the configuration uh, so we have to to get. So we click OK, and finally, so I need just the text. I'm going to put uh, some text here. Okay, like this. Okay, I'm just going to, to align the text to the center, to the middle. So if I want, I can select the button, making a selection and using the alignment options. And that's it. That's it for this tutorial. And um, I hope you enjoy it. And uh, see you in the next one. Oh, don't forget to subscribe if you liked these videos. And uh, Remember that I'm uploading new videos every week and uh, if you liked the video just please thumbs up and uh, see you in the next one.